So just to make this absolutely clear, if someone sneezes into their hands, yeah. not a tissue, and yeah. they then shake hands with someone else, they could potentially pass the virus on. Uh, it, it, it looks, well, most of these viruses don't survive on hands terribly long. So if you happen to see someone cough straight into their hand, put their hand out to you, maybe, I, 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 would, in, I would encourage you whether or not there was coronavirus <laughs> to, to avoid taking that particular hand. Um, <coughs> But if for social reasons you felt you had to, the key thing, it doesn't get in through the skin. So the key thing is if someone washes their hands between that time and when they then touch their face, uh, it is unlikely that transmission will occur. So washing hands is actually really the key. And this is a very big difference. I think people often remember what the advice we gave with Ebola virus. That was a touch-transmitted virus. So the, root, the roots of transmission, the primary roots of transmission were very different. This is primarily a respiratory one with a secondary uh, touch thing, but from respiratory droplets. So just to be even more specific, because a lot of people are concerned about surfaces, um, if someone who had the virus uh, holds a handrail on a bus or a tube and you touch that same handrail two or three hours later, um, is there a risk of transmission? The risk of there will be some risk of transmission, and the risk sort of it sort of peaks immediately after they've done it, and then goes down over time. It's probably largely gone by 48, 48 hours, and almost completely gone by seventy-two hours. So on a hard surface, soft surfaces, viruses last for a shorter period on. So there is a difference between those. But you could catch it if you, you touch the same surface the same day, for example. But not by, and this is the key intermediate step. Just touching it will not give you the virus. It's if you touch it and then touch your face, having not washed your hands between them. So if you go into the tube and you touch the rail, that's fine, but just, just keep, be aware of what you do with your hands. Don't touch your face, wash your hands, and then you can do what you like.